Good morning, fishies. This is my first ever morning routine, and it just so happens to be winter, so this is my winter morning routine. I get up, check the hour, and I go back to sleep. But then I usually can't, so I kind of just like lollygag, kill time, play with my panda that I love. Yes, this is my life. I get bored. I think, do I want to get up or do I want to lay in bed? I want to lay in bed and check Instagram and YouTube and Twitter on my phone. It's just so fun and relaxing. Then I get up to use the restroom and then I come back and I check more social media. And then I'm like, okay, just get up. Just get up, Trish. And so I make my bed. And I always make my bed because I like to feel very accomplished. It's the first task of the day accomplished. The rest of the day can only go up conquer it. And then I go in the bathroom and I brush my teeth to get rid of that morning breath because, you know, I just don't like to have stank breath. I just use some basic Colgate and my mouth feels minty fresh. Then I go from sleepy pajamas, oh so cute from Victoria's Secret, to my oh so cute workout clothes. I'm going running. Just kidding. I'm just going walking because that's pace, but hey, it's exercise. So I like to go on my walks and listen to music, and in the wintertime, I like to wear my long sleeve tops like this Victoria's Secret one with some leggings from Victoria's Secret, and my shoes are A6. Testing that awesome balance. This is a fun park because it has all these like cute little like obstacle courses. I love doing them. And on my walk, I'm listening to Santa Baby by, oh, Trisha Paytas, this girl right here. Yeah, download it on iTunes now. <laughs> and then I come home to shower, take off all my stuff, get off all my sweaty clothes, and into the shower I go. And I'm going to do a full shower routine, so no peeking, not yet. It's coming soon, though. Promise. Um, then I finish up my shower, grab my towel, and dry off. This is one of my favorite parts of my morning. It's, like, so relaxing. I love to get in the shower. But I didn't wash my hair. I only wash my hair, like, once a week to preserve it as much as I can. Then I like to Q-tip my ears after a shower because, you know, clean those ears. And I just included this so no one says, oh, you don't wear a deodorant. I do, but I fast forward it so you don't have to, like, watch it because it's weird. Then I make some breakfast. Um, I don't have this, like, every day, but this is, like, a pretty big breakfast for me. But I wanted to make my little Egg McMuffin sandwich. Um, it's really easy and super quick to make, and it's, like, really yummy and, like, really filling for the day. So I start with the bacon. I put it on medium, and I put two strips of bacon in there because it's so yummy, and I love me some bacon. Bacon. And then I cover it with some aluminum foil so that it does not get splashed all over you and burn you. That's not good. Then I make my coffee, which is the most important part of the whole day. And I love my Keurig. Um, I do have a espresso machine, but my Keurig is great. And I have all these different flavors of coffee, and I never know which one to choose from. But I love the Nantucket one. I like the vanilla one. And my favorite, 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 you'll see that I'm picking, is my Starbucks Verona Blend in Blonde Coffee. It is so so yummy. So I just put that in there. And while I am doing that, then I prepare all my other stuff. Ooh, but first I have to pick my mug, which is an awesome favorite part of the day. And today I'm going with my Queen Elsa from Frozen Mug. It just makes me happy. Mugs make me happier than anything. So I put that in there for a big cup of coffee. And then I prepare the other parts of my meal. So I put my English muffin into my Hello Kitty toaster and I just lightly toast it. Once my coffee is done, I take it out and I put a splash of almond milk in there. And it's really not for even like health reasons. It just tastes better to me than like regular milk. It's a little more flavor into it. So I put the almond milk in my coffee. That's a little more than a splash, but it's really yummy. I would highly recommend it. And then I make the egg to make it nice and hot as the remainder of the meal. And I just fry it on up, just crack it and let it cook. And then I serve myself on a little plate. As you can see on my mugs back there, <laughs> a little obsessed. And once my breakfast is all done, I grab a napkin and my coffee, and I check emails, upload videos, watch YouTubes, check Twitter, all of the above. I really like this part of the morning, too. Actually, good hour spent on the computer in the mornings. Finishing up my sandwich, and then back in the bathroom I go to give my face a wash. I'm just doing the Proactive 3 piece system right now. It seems to work the best on my skin. Leaves it nice and clear, free of acne, and yeah, put the toner on, let that dry for a minute, and then I put on the repairing lotion with different fingers so not to spread the bacteria around in my face. And of course, turn off those lights, save the energy. 
Now it's makeup. It's going through really quickly because this is not really a tutorial, but this is my kind of go-to makeup. I was going to use the YSL foundation, but ended up going with the Kat Von D Tattoo Locket because it's just really great coverage. And in the wintertime, I like a little more of a fuller coverage, flawless finish, and I love me some matte finish. And with that, I used the Rocky Horror Picture Show MAC Translucent Powder. Now I'm just priming my eyes like I always do with my Painterly Paint Pot from MAC. And this is a whole MAC day because now I'm using Carbon from my MAC palette. And this is just really easy, really quick. Just throw some black eyeshadow on, but you look like put together, which I really like doing when I don't want to like, you know, blend or think of color schemes. I just do a little black. Make it a little cat eye, and then I take my purple. Don't know the color of it, sorry guys, but I take a purple and I kind of blend that on the top and then put it on the bottom. Brow Envy by Too Faced. I use the lightest color and blonde. Fill in my eyebrows and um, a mascara. Oh no, I'm sorry. This is my gel liner. No, liquid liner from Matt. Then I, you couldn't really see, but I take my pencil for a MAC in a graphite black and I just tight line my eyes and then now I put on the mascara again. It's just a MAC mascara. I don't know. I have a lot of MAC products lately I've been using and loving. And now what am I doing? I must be just like wiping off my hands with a wet one. I don't even know. Oh, no, no, no. I'm peeling off the glue on my eyelashes. I was like, what are you doing, girl? Yeah. And I'm just reapplying the duo glue and I let it get nice and tacky before applying. And this always takes a little finagling, but... Uh, can't go without the lashes. It just adds that dramatic flair. And again, just looks like you're really put together once that glue dries because <laughs> that glue does not look like you're put together. Looks like you're barely put together. But yeah, then I'm just concealing my eyes. And again, it's just a matte concealer in NC20 with my opposite side of my beauty blender. And then I'm contouring with my NARS palette. It's a NARS holiday palette, which is amazing. And that brush is also from NARS. Um, love that blush, but I decided to use Azalea by MAC because it's more Barbie, which is kind of the look I ended up going for without really knowing. Um, and then this is just MAC Candy Yum Yum, which I think is so gorgeous, and I love it for the winter. I don't really wear color, but in the winter I do. I think it's like really fun and bright. Now comes the fun part, the hair. I always curl my hair with my trusty Anumi Curl Jam set. This is the best curling set in my opinion. It comes with a nice big barrel for loose curls. The medium barrel, which is my most go-to barrel. This little guy, which creates fun curls for the holidays. And this one that goes down, which creates a full curl at the top and a tighter curl at the bottom. Gives it a nice dimension, but I am gonna be using that little one that you see already attached to the wand. And yeah, so basically this is not one, not two, not three, but four day hair. The curl holds amazing. I used the medium barrel to originally curl it four days ago, but today I'm gonna go with the baby one just to give it a more festive look, just to put a little more effort into it. But yeah, it just leaves it really shiny, really healthy. I really love their wands for that reason. It's so now I'm just sectioning off my bangs because I don't always wear my bangs, but today I'm going to just to kind of change up my look. And again, going with that like little Barbie look, I am brushing out all my curls to give it a nice smooth start, so a new smooth primer, if you will. And I'm just tying it to the side because it looks like it's down without having it be all the way down. And I can just kind of give a different style than just having it all down. It just makes it a little lighter, a little more fun. So I'm not going to use the glove. You can if you want, but I've curled my hair enough times that I really don't need it. I'm just sectioning off my pony because it's like a nice big full one and I'm just wrapping the curls flatly against it and letting it go. Now, normally when I wear my hair completely down, I wrap away from my face, but with this look, I wrap towards because I want that more curled look. Not the effortless look, but like I actually put time to curl my hair, not just throw it up. So just singing my favorite tunes. And if you're looking for a great gift to give like your friend, your mom, your sister, your girlfriend, Secret Santa, this is just like every girl's dream. You're getting five wands in one, and it's just a really great set. You can have it for years. You really never have to replace it. Numi just has always been tried and true. I've literally used them for the past like five years. You go to videos from like years ago and I was using them. I just really like it. It's the one I always go back to just because my hair just seems to be the healthiest and it always looks the best and just holds a style really, really well. So. If you are interested in getting this for yourself or for a present, um, I do have some discount codes for you guys, which I will link below, and I'll put all the links and stuff like that. But Santa Fishies will get you 70% off the entire New Me website, and Naughty List will get you 25% off their entire already discounted New Me holiday catalog. So hook any up because you guys are awesome and wonderful, and, you know, I just want you all to be glam for the holidays. 
So I'm just finishing it up and as I go higher, I am doing a little bit tighter curls because that is what you see at the top. Um, the bottom I just kind of like go through quickly, but at the top I like to make sure that the curls are beautiful and I just think it gives it a nice texture. I don't think enough girls like actually wear the curl curled look and I really, really like it. And me included, I like to go for effortless, but I just think it's a fun thing. Wear it to a party, a day out, I'm just doing mine for errands basically. And then I just go through with a teasing comb to give it a little bit of volume and it just looks really nice. Now I'm just straightening my hair with this flat iron. It's the In Vogue one that I purchased years ago. Really take advantage of the Santa Fishies code for 70% off to get this because you will not regret it. It is the most amazing thing ever. Then putting in my wonderfully fabulous sparkly pink earrings that I got at some random store at my mall for a super cheap and I love them. And now I'm posing like a little Barbie. Now I'm going in with some, oh hey, Hey Trish, that's me. Is that me? That looks like me. That me? That's me. <laughs> I'm going in with my Trish Shimmering Bronzer and I just love this stuff for the winter to keep me giving a nice healthy glow all year round. And tis the season for holiday savings because that Shimmering Bronzer is 25% off at BeLikeTrish.com. Thousand Wishes by Bath & Body Works. Spray it all over. And then my outfit, I have a cute little Barbie skirt with a camisole, these boots by Aldo, and I just put a little Barbie jacket over because it is still really warm here in LA. Be jealous. <laughs> and the back is super cute. It says, I'm a doll because I am. And then I just paired it with my Chanel pink purse because it's so Barbie B. And I'm just going to go out and run some errands. <laughs> so I just run some errands and I do live by the beach. So I thought I'd include a little shot by the beach to really say, wish you were here. My greeting card to you. And then, yes, I had to pull up to get my camera. <laughs> And I thought it was really funny. I really put effort into this, guys. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I want to say hi to Miranda. And until next time, here are my kisses from my little baby fishies. Mwah! Bye, guys.